Welcome to my channel. If you like my video, then kindly subscribe, like, and watch. Thank you. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Problem 3.20. Statement of problem is the solid rod AB has diameter 60 millimeter. So this is solid rod AB having diameter 60 millimeter. I will also write given data. Solid rod AB having diameter is equal to 60 millimeter and that is made up of steel. Clear? For which allowable sharing stress is 85 megapascal. So allowable sharing stress for this rod AB that is made up of steel is 85 megapascal. The pipe CD which has outer diameter of 90 mm and wall thickness of 6 mm. So this is pipe CD having outer diameter which is D2 that is equal to 90 millimeter and having thickness T is equal to 6 millimeter. So inner diameter for CD will be equal to 90 minus 2 times of thickness that we have discussed in previous problem. So when you put 90 minus 2 times of 6 which is equal to 78 millimeter. So inner diameter of pipe CD is 78 millimeter also the maximum allowable sharing stress for this cd that is equal to 54 mega pascal that is given over here and this pipe cd is made up of aluminium this is for aluminium clear so what we have to find we have to find the maximum torque the largest torque that can be applied at point a so let's start with its solution so for rod a b we will find the torque and for pipe c d we will also find the torque and we will choose the largest torque so let's start for rod AB. As you know that this torque T is equal to uh, T allowable into J divided by C. This comes out from this formula. Ta allowable is equal to T into C divided by J. So this T will be equal to Ta allowable into J divided by C clear also we know that uh, C for solid shaft the diameter is given as 60 millimeter so radius will be equal to 30 millimeter clear so C is equal to 30 divided by 2 which is equal to 15 millimeter and that is equal to 0 0.015 meter clear ta allowable for this rod a b is 80 85 mega pascal so 85 into 10 raised to power 6 so you can put it so torque allowable comes out to be 85 into 10 raised to power 6 multiply by j which is equal to pi by 2 into c4 which is equal to 0 0.015 to power 4 and divide by C which is 0 0.015 so when you solve this this torque allowable in rod AB comes out to be 3.6 into 10 raised to power 3 Newton into meter so this is torque allowable torque or maximum torque that can be applied on rod AB. For pipe CD, CD, we have to find the torque allowable in CD. And this torque allowable will be equal to torque allowable in CD into J of CD 
divided by outer radius that is C2 clear so you can put the value torque allowable in CD is given as 54 megapascal D1 and D2 is also given so torque allowable, uh, allowable was 54 into 10 raised to power 6 here this is torque allowable in CD JCD is equal to pi by 2 into C2 minus C1 C2 is 90 divided by 2 which is 45 and C1 is 39 which is D1 over 2 so 45 which is 0 0.045 whole square minus 39 which is 0 0.039 whole 4 not square sorry 4 there divide by C2 which is equal to 0 0.045 so again when you solve this uh, the torque allowable in CD comes out to be 3.36 into 10 raised to power 3 newton so now we have allowable torque in AB which is 3.6 and uh, in rod AB and torque allowable in CD, pipe CD is 3.36. So allowable torques we, uh, we have to ask to choose the largest torque. So allowable torque for safer design is smaller value smaller value which is torque is equal to 3.36 into 10 to the power 3 newton meter now this torque is the smallest torque that can be applied at point a for the safer design so we have to choose the smallest value again if you choose the largest value so when you put this largest value of torque in the formula of maximum sharing stress in cd so the shear stress in cd will be exceed than 54 megapascal which is not acceptable and uh, that's why we are choosing the smallest value i hope you have got uh, the point and you have enjoyed the video as well thank you for watching